just one example. This render is good, but this render is good too. What is the difference? The render time. For this render, render time was 20% faster than the previous. To reach this goal, don't forget something. Optimize its focus power where is useful. At the end of this video, I will show to you how to make the principal shader optimize a variable when Blender starts. Discover the principal shader optimized, 20% faster, preserved ergonomics and easy to made. So open Blender and follow the guide. For once, do not delete this legendary cube. <laughs> we are going to create a material for it. So display the node editor and click on new. Remove the default diffuse node and begin with the clear screen. No, add our shader score, the principal shader. To the side of this one, we are going to make the simplest dielectric shader. We need to pick only one node, the diffuse node. I put this in frame, which I rename simplified dielectric. Next shader family, metallic. Only glossy node is needed for that. I also put this in frame and I rename it Simplified Metallic. Now, just for a good comprehension between us, I create another frame, which includes my two previous frames. This is my Simplified Principal Shadow. Select all nodes with B and use Ctrl J to make a group. For this group, all inputs are same as Principal Shadow inputs. So, do connections. The hand is near, just three nodes remaining. Add a mix shader between simplified electric and metallic, and yes, obviously we drive it with metallic input. Simplified shader and principal shader share few inputs, like base color, which I connect to diffuse and glossy. Also, I can connect roughness input to glossy node. And do you look that one input remains, normal. But no, don't use normal in simplified shader. This is the main tips. Your faster render is here. Don't use normal in simplified shader. For finish, we will add two nodes for make a switch between the principal shader and the simplified principal shader. For that, Add a mix shader and connect to two shaders, simplified and not simplified. Don't forget, optimization is focus power where it's useful. In conclusion, we will use the principal shader only for face directly visible by the camera. Add a light path node and connect camera ray to fuck input. Now we can connect our last mix shader to the group's output. I rename it Optimized. I'm going to link the principal shader directly to group's output. You can use it if you need to make shader other than dielectric or metallic, like glass for example, or what you want, another more specific shader. How to make the principal shader optimized available when Blender starts? It's very, very easy. Just click on file and save start file. Now, for the next start, Blender will open this file like a default file. And you can still see your principal shader optimized. Well, now you have a way to speed up your render. Do it, please do it. You will save your time every day. So you will learn Blender more faster. And who knows? Perhaps you will reduce your coffee consumption. <laughs> Subscribe to take advantage of next videos. Let me your feedback with likes or comments. Share with your brand of friends. See you soon. And like said the French philosopher Virgil, we grow tired of everything except learn. Bye bye.